Hey brother, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you why I don't dropship on eBay and what I do with that. I import stock from China and hold it in my house. And then after that, I order to all of our customers on a daily basis. So why I choose to follow this route instead of doing dropshipping on eBay? I'm going to be discussing this in today's video. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification so don't miss out any of my future videos. And don't forget to make a quick like and make a comment below. Let's get started. I'm sure that a lot of people are going to get value from this video so let's jump right into the video let's not waste any more time now i will go through the reason why i decided to import stock when it comes to selling on ebay instead of doing drug shipping a lot of people are gonna to get value from this video so keep watching now a lot of people don't know how to start drug shipping and what they should do when it comes to selling on ebay let's know what is ebay drug shipping exactly is as you know once you make a sale the supplier will ship it out when you list the product on ebay I know this might sound good but there is a lot of disadvantages because you don't actually give a whole physical goods and you don't have to actually invest anything upfront and you need to know that when it comes to dropshipping there is a lot of disadvantages I'm gonna show you why I decided to import stock and hold it myself now we need to know the reasons why I decided to import stock and hold it myself why I decided to not do dropshipping because there is a low priority in entry anyone can sign up to eBay today and you need to list products that they don't actually have and after that you need to buy the products from aliexpress anyone can do that if you do it that way which means that there is going to be a level of high competition i will show you now what i do i unboot stock and haul the stock myself a lot of people who don't have the money to be able to invest it in stock straight away it's going to be a benefit for me and it will not easy for a lot of people to do not a lot of people are going to be able to do it the second reason why i decided to import stock because i'm able to do that i will ship it out to my customers myself and it will take two or three days and if you are gonna drop from aliexpress it will take between 15 to 30 days now you ask me why i import stock these are one of the main reasons there is no there is so many sellers so that i'm able to get ahead of the competition on ebay and when it comes to selling on ebay it's market less fill and i'm able to offer express delivery to my customers with the products so you need to be able to have a USB which is a unique selling point I wouldn't have been able to grow my stories to the level without on two days shipping always remember that someone else is shipping out the goods for you you won't be able to build a long-term business when you buy especially when the supplier is based overseas and it would be beneficial if you do find the suppliers in the UK and I don't advise to drop ship from China and if you are going to have a drop from China and if you are going to get a good price too and if you are going to get a good price for the product and if you are able to get the product at a cheap price always bear in mind that it's going to take a really long time for uh, to reach your customer always remember if you are going to be shipping with the goods from china it will take a long time always bear in that in your mind it's going to take a really long time for uh, to reach your customer within that time your customer will not going to be happy with that level of service and maybe the customer request the item now there is a question that i want to ask is ebay dropshipping even allowed i'm going to break it down right now dropshipping as product sourcing is a way of selling items on ebay where you fulfill orders directly from a wholesale supplier is allowed on ebay without ever handling the items yourself dropshipping remember if you use dropshipping you are still responsible for the safe delivery of the item and the buyer's satisfaction with the product so ebay is basically saying that they don't mind if you drop ship but there is an important part that everyone needs to know if they want to drop ship on ebay and then purchasing the item from marketplace that ships directly to your customers or from another retailer is not allowed on ebay and if you don't follow ebay's policy could result in a rank of actions including cancelling or ending or selling instructions and most importantly account suspension or demoting all listings from search results decreased seller rating buying and you ask me now why did my account get closed down this is because when you drop from other places or any other website amazon aliexpress for example this is probably the reason why ebay don't like it so there is a number of disadvantages to this as well if you don't basically hold the stock yourself one of the disadvantages is that before you send the item to the customer you are not able to shake the item and if you 
deliver to your supplier to package up the item and ship it to your customer they may not do it in the way that you want them to they may not pick it right if you are not basically able to ship the item yourself and when the customer receives the item you don't really have full control over you don't really have full control over how your customer is going to react so you need to decide to import the stock yourself so that to be able to package it in the way that you want and take a look on it before it reaches the customer and you will know how pieces of a specific product that you have on hand at any time another saying that you don't want to do is sell an item on your ebay store and then the supplier returns around and say that they don't have any more left in stock it actually affects your account and ebay don't like this because you now have to reform the pair on ebay so this is another reason why i decided to import the stock before i actually sell it that i can have it in my house so if i know that i have only got two left i turn around and tell them that i don't have any more left in stock and I am able to set the amount of two on my eBay store so that I don't end up selling to a customer. Another reason that I want to say it to you is why I decided to import stock rather than dropship. It's gonna cost me more in the long run in the short term. If I choose to go down the dropshipping route, it may be cheaper, but each individual unit or product is going to cost you less than if you was a dropship. If I bought 20 pieces of a specific product, for example, it might cost me for dollars per unit whereas if i was to drop ship that same item one by one from from the supplier it might cost me six dollars per unit i found the winning product i know that i'm going to be able to sell each one i would rather buy it in bulk and before it reaches a customer you need to make sure it looks nice and it's definitely going to cost you in that short term in the long run you make more money because if you buy in bulk the item is going to be cheaper i hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification so don't miss out any of my future videos and don't forget to make a quick like and make a comment below stay safe and good